on today's episode, we're going to be knocking out Snake River Farm Beef Ribs. Hey, if you love to grill and barbecue, then this is the channel for you. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and click that bell so you don't miss a thing. So first of all, I gotta give a shout out to Snake River Farms. I was talking to them over there and I was like, man, I wish I could do beef ribs like the way you guys sell them and bam, guess what I found? In the mail two days later, some beef ribs. So shout out to Snake River Farm for providing this meat. We're just gonna get right into it. We're not gonna do much, anything special on these. I'll probably do um, a couple different flavor profiles. Maybe uh, SPG and Texas beef on one, and then cow cover hot and Texas beef on another. We're, uh, we're gonna be cooking these on the stick burner today. We got the pit, the L-Ray running right at about 300. So we're gonna do a light coat of cow cover hot, a little bit of Texas beef. Make sure to get the sides. That thing's so thick it just stands there. That's a cow cover hot. And then Texas beef. It's gonna give us that nice Texas bark. And then on this rack, SPG. It's gonna give you some killer bark too with that Texas flavor. And then that Texas beef. All right, so we're gonna let these sweat out for probably about uh, 10 minutes, 15 minutes, whatever it takes. Straight onto the pit. It's running at 300 right now. I'm gonna try to bring that temperature down to about 285 because we just wanna kinda do a, a slower cook on these, turn that fat into just straight up beef butter, which we all love. All right, so we got our pit up to temp and we're gonna get these babies on. Been right at an hour. They're uh, starting to look really good. We're getting some nice color, but I'm just gonna rotate them. It'll probably take about another hour to get our color, maybe an hour, hour and a half. But as soon as we do, we'll wrap them and get this thing go. Alright, so they finally hit 207. It's been right at about five hours. We're gonna pull them out, let them rest for about 30 minutes, and then get to cutting in them. Alright, so we got them steamed out. Man, they smell freaking amazing. I'm just gonna pull them out, put them both on the cutting board. Oh, geez, dude. God. Turn them this way. This is the SPG, this is the cow cover. So I'm just gonna jump right in and we're gonna try them. Oh my gosh, that knife just fell right through there. This is the uh, SPG and this is the cow cover hot. SPG, Texas beef, cow cover hot and Texas beef. Oh my gosh. Dude, that's, that's my favorite. No, that's so good, dude. All right, so leave me a comment below. Have you ever had a beef rib this big? And hey, I want to thank you for watching. As always, make sure to smash that subscribe button and ring that bell so you don't miss a thing. And I'll catch you in the next video. Peace.